Hello everybody, this is the Young Gamer here, and today we're on Fintai is doing another mod review. Yes, this is the Yamal, and it is brought to us by Gregor24. Oh, it's very cool. It is really cool. Okay. It is awesome. I put, it, I put it into really low gear there to get it out of that, and it just looks awesome. Unfortunately, there's not a lot of information available about them. If you oh. search for Yamal, Yamal is the name of the company that build the trucks. They build all sorts of vehicles. They're Russian, we know that much. <laughs> um, but if you, they don't have much of an online presence, so if you Google them, there's not much information available about them at all. What we do know is that Yamal, the name Yamal, comes from, there's an area um, up in northwest Siberia that's called the Yamal Peninsula and the company's named after that area simply because, as you can imagine, up there it's pretty cold and uh, the terrain is pretty hostile. It's a sort of area where the local indigenous population, the sort of main, um, the main uh, Enterprise mainly manufacturing for them is looking after reindeers. Really? Um, yeah, and there's also Yamal. There's also named after there's a, the world's biggest icebreaker ship. Wow! Is named the Yamal, and it's also named and obviously that's also named Yamal because it can go to some pretty hostile locations. I saw these icebreakers in um, Pete St. Petersburg when I was there one time. Oh. Yeah. So the basically Yamal make vehicles that are designed to, to operate in these hostile environments and bear in mind that uh, the Yamal Peninsula has some of the largest reserves of gas, in, of natural gas in the world yes. which the Russians are shortly going to start uh, mining for or drilling for um, these trucks you can imagine will be in great demand Yeah. I like the fact that, uh, let's see, it's articulated it's, art it's an articulated joint just behind the cab there but the front wheels also, if you look closely, the front wheels also turn. Yeah. And and I love the fact that, as you can see, it's articulated, but it also sort of swivel, you know, rotates about its um, longitudinal axis there. So it's, um, what should I say, it rotates around its transverse axis, which means that the cab goes in a different direction to the body of the truck sometimes, That's as you cool. see when it goes over when it goes over a bump. Yeah, because it's got independent, independent suspension. It does have independent suspension or whatever it is it's called. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, so I'm carrying the utility trailer on this one at the moment. This comes with 18 different add-ons, which yeah. we'll have a look at uh, towards the you know the second part of the video. I'm I'm I've got the um, utility uh, utility unit and also the utility trailer behind this one at the moment. Oh. You can do logging, of course, with it. You can carry every, every basically everything that any other sort of truck can carry. That logo on the front looked very familiar. Do you think it? But you thought it looked a bit like a man, didn't you? Yes. But I don't. I don't think. I think it's just coincidence because I don't. There's certainly nothing that suggests that they're. Maybe they're owned by man, but I don't know. It doesn't say anything about that. Um, the tire. You see the, 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 all the huge tires on them because they're really, really low pressure tires. Ah. Yeah, this is me trying to get into this little. Uh, it doesn't. It doesn't have the greatest turning circle as you can imagine, but uh, pretty much nothing I found on this particular map would stop it. This <laughs> an absolute tank. Exactly. They make loads of other types of trucks as well. Um, so I'll put up some pictures of of a whole bunch of other trucks. But for now, we'll just look because there's not much more you can say about this truck because there's no more information available. But what we'll do is. Um, We'll just watch a bit of uh, awesomeness from this truck and then we'll come back again a little bit later and uh, have a look at what's in the truck, what yeah. you get with it. Alright, so enjoy the next couple of minutes and we'll see you after that.
so then we're now going to look at what you get for this um, vehicle. Mm -hmm. You get a cart, which looks like... Yeah, do that cart, and then do. there's another cart that comes with it as well. So do the other cart, keep it like that, and then put the other cart on, and we'll see if we can see what the difference keep is. Keep it like that there. Yeah. And then you get... Oops. And you get... Cart 2... I'm ah, not I sure. see. What, was it? what is it? The one, the back, the rear end, like peg thingy, has been moved uh, further back. Look, is I'll it? show you, right? You can see right there, right? Yeah. There's a little ledge for like a like a turning one. Mm -hmm. Look, I put the cart on. Okay. All oh, right. That's interesting. I wonder what difference that makes then. I'm not when sure. you actually got logs on. Maybe it's longer logs, so you can actually turn the trees. Oh, well, I know. One of them will be for if you want to carry, like, that one there will be if you want to carry, like, the really long logs, the massive logs. Yeah. And the other one will be if you want to carry just small logs just on the back of that one. Yeah. Okay, that's good. You also get a visor up the front. Right there, can you see it? Well, it has a reflection on it actually, mm -hmm. that's pretty cool. That's good. Yeah, you also get a fuel, like a massive fuel tank on the back mm -hmm. of it. 500 litres of fuel. 550, 500 litres. You also get uh, a spoiler. A spoiler for the top. Mm -hmm. Make it look like a proper man on Mercedes or mm -hmm. something. You get a cistern. Like yeah, cistern. normal cistern. Looks a bit more round. You get the Tegler, which I'll do in a minute. I'll position That's the standard uh, sort of. Uh, there's the utility uh, utility unit. That's what we were using. Well, looks, it says mega van. That to me looks mega like van. that looks to me looks like kind of quite medical. It looks like a little medical unit, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, it does. You get the Tukamahana. That goes in the top. Oh, it's like you a roof. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I like that. You get the kangaroo. Yeah, that looks really, really cool. Like a massive bull bar down there. Yeah, and the winch. Yep. Yep. You get takamanga. That's a different type. Okay, that's just uh, okay. Yeah. You also get the garage. Okay, garage trailer, garage utility, a garage. Ah, uh, oh, no, look at the. So you got a bit of graffiti. Bit of graffiti on it. Yeah. Pretty yeah. A bit about just these scratches. You also get the visor too. Right. Okay. Oh, oh, that's, oh, that's just got a little bit of gold. It looks like it's got a bit of gold yeah. or, or wood or something down it. Okay. Yeah. You get the Yamaha. Oh, uh, the Kung. Kung. Yeah. You can put the you put the um, radar on as well for this one because it's got ah. radar. Military style. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. Well, that's Kung there. You also get the Sistan Nave. Oh, that's the. Oh, so the Sistan trailer. Yeah, the Sistan trailer. Make a fuel tanker. You get the garage parts trailer. The usual ones. Uh, that looks different, actually. Oh, it does, doesn't it? Press V and just take it. Let's have it with the colour. Oh, it's like a, a grey colour, like a white grey. Yeah, yeah nice. Yeah, a bit of mud on it. Yeah, like that. You also get the garage trailer, which is different. Just to Okay, yeah, that. it does, doesn't it? Got beacons. Beacons, as usual. Up front. Yep. You can barely see them in blue. You've also got the log cart. Log cart, standard sort of... Yeah, standard sort of log car. Mm -hmm. Then you've also got. I'm still them beacons. Then you've also got the. Whoops. You've also got that one. Yeah, no more. You've also got that normal, normal. Right, and the wheels? Wait, there's some things that are unavailable. Wait a minute. You can see them in the red there if you want to see them. Oh that's yeah, it's that, that long, that's, the that's long. That's the floaty radar. Yeah. There's the capon. Oh, that's the okay. So put the um, fuel on again. Put the assist, put the fuel. Fuel. Yeah. Then put the crane on. Does that mean you can now put the crane on? Would you need to put the crane on? Oh, you need that thing there. Yeah, yeah it looks pretty cool, doesn't it? Yep. Then okay, so let's have a look at the wheels. Got to quickly uninstall these. So there we go. So you get highway wheels, which right. look like that there. They look like the normal truck wheels in the game. Mm -hmm. They're not highway wheels. <laughs> not <laughs> like highways that we know. <laughs> no, not what we know. Maybe what they know, but not what we know. You're off road. Oh my gosh, master truck wheels. Yeah. Off road wheels look like that. Number two, slightly different. Uh, it's a different tread pattern. Okay. Yep. 
and then number three. Okay. And then you've also got the default wheels, which is bigger. The, the default wheels are the first off-road wheels. Oh, These wheels, yeah, they're pretty cool. They look cool. They're a bit big. Yeah. Yeah. So just to just to remind you, that was by Gregor Twenty Four, was it? Gregor, I think yes. Mhm. Mm yeah. Seven. That's all pretty awesome darned mods, if you ask me. What's it like inside? Uh, uh, you oh, only get the view on top, unfortunately. Yeah, that's unfortunate. It, it, it's okay. It's a very good mod, actually. Yeah. You can yeah. also see the engine. Does it rumble when you rev it? He says. He says this model is freely available on the internet. He says the author of the envelope. I'm not sure that maybe that's the template. The is engine Ilya. rumbles. Oh yeah, and when you rev it up, it, that thing that exhaust shakes. Yeah, when you rev it, when I revved it up, it started to rumble. Go rev it up again. I mean, not when I revved it, when I started it. Look, look at it. Yeah, <laughs> nice, nice. Mm. Yeah, so Ilya, I think Ilya's got something to do with the making of the base model or something like that. That model looks very amazing. Yeah, what are those? Are they are those winch points on the side? Are they? Straight. Well, then there. No. Inside, look at that. Strange place to have winch points, really. Oh, yeah. But yeah, they are. Interesting. Right, okay. Yeah, so that. So remember to subscribe, like for more content. And that yep. will be a goodbye from me. And a goodbye from me. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you for watching the video. Click one of these boxes to watch another one of our videos. And remember to click subscribe to subscribe.